Hello, welcome back to Rick's Kits. Here is a update and potentially a finalization on the uh, 1959 Cadillac Eldorado Seville or the small scale group build. So this is where we're up to and we're close to buttoning this one up. We've got the body all painted. Nice and glossy. We used um, our metal foil all around the bottom here and the main part that goes up there. I didn't fancy painting that by hand. But apart from that, all the like the stainless, I would assume it's stainless, even up the side fin up the top here. That is all painted with LP sparkling silver, uh, door handles, etc. The Eldorado. Um, lights on the front and the badges they're all LP Silverado Sparkling Silver sorry Silverado that was Silverado um got a re-chrome we've re-chromed these come out really nice quite happy with the way they came out um we got the Little bullet lights, and they are tiny. They're all done in red, clear red. Grab these ones. We got the rear. I don't know. We get in. There we go. They're done in red with chrome. They're ready to do um, that. Boot is painted. In white, got the interior tub done, all glued together, um, bit dark. Got the let me find something to point with instead of using a big fat chunky finger, gets in the way. Got anything to point with? Um, cocktail stick, there we go. So we got red light lens in there. It's not focusing very well, is it? You see it in the corner. Door, door lens, door light, door lens. Dash is all done. All the chrome door handles and everything, they're all done. The pipe work's all done on work piping. Plus, my, I'm getting me mucking birds waddled this morning. Uh, so yeah, so all the pipe work, piping is done, door handles done, That's ready to pop away inside the um, chassis, on the chassis and inside the body. Um, one other thing I noticed on this kit while I was um, prepping it for paint, which I had to deal with, um, there was a break. Right, you can, probably, you can just about see there, there's a break straight through the middle of the uh, top there. So I've had to glue it. Unfortunately, those supports that were there didn't, didn't support it very well and it snapped in the middle. So uh, a little bit of touching up to do on the top here. But yeah, other than that, this is just literally ready to button up and put away. Um, just drop the tub in there for give you an idea of what it will look like roughly next time we uh, next time I come back with it. Uh, it's going to be something like that been fun, it's been interesting, that's for sure. Sorting out all this tiny little bits of models. It's quite detailed. Let's go back to the tub. It's quite detailed in the old tub, you know. The little um, door handles and the window 
buttons there, the, the light, the piping that goes round, it all, it's all well detailed. It's almost as if they took the big kit of this in, uh, it was 124th, 125th, and just shrunk it. It's, it's very, very, very crisp detail in here. Very crisp detail. Got a bit of satin varnish that I need to put over these seats because I want them to look a bit more uh, leathery looking, I suppose, as opposed to they are at the moment, which is a bit flat. I've got another bit of satin varnish. I want to go across the top on that as well, just to make the difference between that and the carpet that's in there. But yeah, that's where we're at. I'll come back. Excuse me, I'll come back to you when we're buttoned up and she's ready to show. So we'll see you in a bit. Hey, welcome back. As you can see, I've got her all buttoned up. She's all finished. Apart from the rear view mirror, which um, went walkabout. I tried to pick it up with a pair of tweezers to... Uh, it in place and she pinged off somewhere and hmm, unless I get a hoover with a bit of rag across the front I do not think I'm going to find her there's too much crap on the floor underneath my feet as it is so uh, another day I'm going to find her so there she is she's finished very very glossy not a bad kit very nice fitment there is literally no fitment issues whatsoever in this kit. Goes together perfectly well. Uh, all the chrome has come out really great. I'm 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 pleased with this. I had fun putting this one together. I gave her wire walls, wire wheels. Didn't give her any white walls. Um, I just didn't have the patience to paint white walls today. Um, she's got the um, what to call it, buff interior. All the ash and everything's done. We've got the tiny little bullet lights on the back. Oh, that fiddly! She was sausage fingers. The other lights are in the back as you can see uh, I couldn't save the Eldorado decal unfortunately that was too far gone even with a bit of uh, decal stuff to go over the top it, it wouldn't save them way 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 too far to go so yeah there she is hope you like her I say thanks to BG and uh, Dawn for putting this group build on. Thank you very much. I enjoyed it. I've had fun. And now I can sit back and watch everybody else put theirs together. So thanks for watching. Leave a comment below. Like, share. See you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.